I remember back when the Mac Fund started and thinking, you know, if we could raise or they could raise $50,000 a year, that would be fantastic. We didn't have a bone marrow transplant program until the early 80s. And because of the Mac Fund support, we were one of the first places in the country to do unrelated bone marrow transplants. We are so fortunate to have an incredibly strong partnership with the Mac Fund. There is no question that our cancer, blood disorders, and bone marrow transplant program is as strong as it is today because of the generous support of the Mac Fund for more than 35 years. The investments that the Mac Fund has made in the research that underlies what we do with transplant has revolutionized the way transplants are done here and elsewhere. We're now a phase one institution, which means we test the new drugs that come on the market. I'm not sure without the Mac Fund support we'd be at that level. The Mac Fund support has given us the flexibility to get new recruits and to develop ideas that otherwise would not have had the support to develop. Because we have received such wonderful support from the Mac Fund, we have been able to focus on our blood disorders such as sickle cell disease. D. John was actually diagnosed with sickle cell anemia SS, which is a more severe form of the disease. I had a bone marrow transplant from my brother, Devin. The Mac Fund has helped us transform pediatric oncology and blood disorders in Milwaukee and Wisconsin. I don't want to go through as much pain as I did in the past few years. So I'm more healthy now and I can do more things like regular kids. We are incredibly grateful for their latest commitment for pediatric research. This will ensure that our ability to provide tremendous care and great hope for our kids with cancer and blood disorders can continue. A significant commitment like the Mac Fund just made assures the fact that we can continue to recruit fantastic physicians. The giant ripple effect that you guys create by sending kids out of these doors as survivors is more enormous than you could ever know. Without the Mac Fund, you'd have very, very good programs, but you wouldn't be at the cutting edge. You wouldn't be uh, the one sort of leading the way. And I think we've been able to do that. They have been a tremendous asset, tremendous encouragement, tremendous support for what we do. Without the Mac Fund, we wouldn't be where we are. On behalf of our patients, their families, our providers, and all of us at Children's Hospital Wisconsin, thank you, Mac Fund. Thank you, Mac Fund. Thank you, Mac Fund. Thank you, Mac Fund. Thank you, Mac Fund.